Carter takes over the UNC system. Margaret Spellings will begin her job as UNC system president. North Carolina news reporter Justin Quisenberry is live in Chapel Hill with a look at how concerns about her, her new appointments driving students to take action today. Justin. Yeah, some students, faculty, and staff as well plan a walkout here at UNC Chapel Hill as well as other campuses in the UNC system. Here at Chapel Hill, that will take place at 11 a.m. with the crowd gathering on the front steps here at Wilson Library. All of this, a public show of opposition against her appointment. No peace! You will be absolutely... This was the scene at the Board of Governors meeting in January when protesters interrupted the meeting and some were arrested. Those opposed to her getting the job say it was too political, criticizing Spelling's record, which includes overseeing the launch of No Child Left Behind and serving on the board of a company that collects student loan debt. Spelling's also served as U.S. Education Secretary under President George W. Bush. The NAACP is pushing for answers. The group's lawyer filed a public records request looking for more details about the Board of Governors' decision to get rid of Tom Ross as president and hire spellings. The NAACP says that was done in secret. I'm asking others in the community, my fellow students here, and anyone to fight the hiring of this woman, who especially was hired in a very undemocratic process. In our next half hour, hear from Spellings about this outcry against her and find out what her first few days on the job will be like. For now, Justin Quisenberry, North Carolina News, Chapel Hill.